What is up everyone? In this video, we'll explore Facebook Marketplace so you can buy and sell items efficiently. So let's get started. Let's open the Facebook app. In here, you'll see this small shop type icon. This is Marketplace. On the main interface, you'll see the products you are mostly searching for. Your location is at the top. Click it to change it. You can search for your location from the top and this is the radius slider to adjust the distance from your location. We'll talk about buying stuff first. Tap the search bar to find something. We have some categories to select from. However, I'm just gonna look up iPhone. One tip I must mention is that to find the best value on trending items like iPhones, televisions, cars, etc. Go to this filter and click sort by. Here choose this newest first. What this will do is show you items by time. Trending items sell out quickly, so you can see the latest listings with this option. You also have other filters to adjust your search results. Tap on a listing to see all the details. Swipe on the photos to see them one by one. Down below we have the message option, item description, seller information and lastly the pickup location. To get updates for similar listings, Click this alerts icon. We can also send them an offer. Tap in here will show you a few options and you can select one and click on send. We can also share this listing or save it. This is the default message to send to the seller. However, you can click it to edit it before sending it. I have compiled a message that will send. Once sent, we can click here to open the messages or we can open messenger. In Messenger, you'll see a separate tab titled Marketplace where you'll find all Marketplace messages. The top is the most recent one. On this interface, you can tap here to go to the listing page or click here to see other options. All the conversations will happen in this chat. Let me show you one of my old purchases. You'll negotiate the price, decide on where to meet and do everything else on Messenger. Once the item is sold, the seller will mark the listing as sold to remove it from Marketplace. Alright, let's learn to sell items on Marketplace. Go to the main dashboard. Here you'll see the sell button. Tap in here shows a few options. Each comes with its own set of questions to fill in. Let's select items. First are photos. Tap on the photos to add and click next. You can also use your camera to take photos. Then is the title. Make it catchy and relevant. Then set your item price. I'll put in $30. Marketplace automatically sets the category, but you can tap here and select the product category. Then set your item condition. For me, it's new. The description is where you would specify the item condition, issues, features, pickup location, etc. You can also insert the item brand. Then tap the location option to select your location. I'll put in my suburb and click apply. Tags are important. These help searches find your item. Type something and press the comma key to set it as a tag. Add a few related tags. This availability is to set the selling type. If you have multiple items, select the stock option. If it's just one, list it as a single item. Then check those to let buyers know about your meeting preferences. Lastly, if you like to hide this listing from your Facebook friends for any reason, check this. Great, our listing is ready. Tap on the top next button. Facebook will show you groups in your location where you can post this listing. However, as the hide from friends is checked, we can't post this listing to any group. Tap publish to publish this listing. All listings on Marketplace go under review. You can tap this listing and check this to get notified when it goes live. To see your seller account and listings, tap this tiny profile icon. Here you'll see all the options. Tap your listings to see your active and past listings. You can see I've sold many things on Marketplace. The top is where you find your seller ratings and information. Now suppose you have found a buyer and have sold the item. Open this listing and you will find this out of stock option. If you sold it as one item, you would see the sold button. 
tap on it. Facebook will ask you where you sold the item. If you check the Facebook option, you'll see all the people who messaged you. You can select the buyer or skip that step. Nobody messaged me, so I can't click on sold it on Facebook. So we covered buying and selling on Facebook Marketplace. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and take care.